We got 18 points. So I'm gonna buy some stuff. Probably after I wipe these guys out. There's a there's a bunch of them floating around. Um, let's get this now. Yo 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 everybody, what's going on? Is Lodi's here back with another Nordic Ashes run? Hopefully y'all have enjoyed the content. If so, make sure you guys tap that like button down below. If you guys are new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. 98% of you guys not subscribed, so make sure you guys smash that button down there. Without further ado, let's jump right on into this. We're going to play some Half Grim, and hopefully we can make some progress. Um, we're going to be running um, Expert Mode on Alpine, but we're going to do the first wave without buying anything from the shop, because this will unlock uh, this character here, which will be pretty sweet. And uh, yeah, we'll see. Uh, we'll see who that unlocks. But without further ado, let's jump right on into this, and hopefully we can catch some double U's. Uh, we are doing the ice run as well, so we'll see how that goes. Uh, projectiles, cooldown, damage, area, sure. Um, I mean, sure, that works. Let's see if we can make something happen here. See if we can make something happen here, eh? Okay, I mean, burn damage, sure. Um, we'll see how that goes. I do like that he teleports, because we didn't take any damage there. I will save all my gold for the second shop. Um, where we can, like, dump some money into, and hopefully we can make some pretty good progress. Um, we are getting a little swarmed, which is a little worrisome. Ooh, we're doing ice. Um, the trail now deals 1 to 2 damage on contact with an enemy. Frozen enemies stay still. Let's do this one. Oh, it's not... Ah, man, I forgot. It's not permanent, so maybe we should have took the trail. Because that 1 to 2 damage could add up pretty quickly. One bullet. Red heart chest container. Um, let's work our way over this way. Okay. Yeah, this is a little sketch, man. Not gonna lie. Not going to lie at all. Little sketchy. Like, don't get me wrong, we're not doing too bad, but it is a little sketchy. Full red heart container, I'll take. It's not too bad. We're there. Um, let's see. Doing all right. Why are you not killing that guy? There you go. Damn it. Okay. On. Jeez Louise, man. Area, movement speed, duration. I'm gonna go for area, I think, on this. Could be interesting. 100 kills for plus one damage. I mean, sort of trash, but I'll take it. Sort of trash, but I'll take it. Um, yeah, I'll take... I'll take that, and I'll definitely take that. Um, I'll juice this up as well, as long with this one. Okay. This could be very interesting. Um, damage I'm okay with. Um, or not damage, projectiles I'll be okay with, with uh, the ice one, because we can get multiple that go off in uh, different directions. Um, reduce the dash cooldown by 35? Yeah, I'll definitely take that. I'll definitely take that. Be useful since we teleport with him. That could be super good. Uh, we do have damage and crit, it looks like, for our two, uh, monoliths. 
Okay, well that kind of sucks. Get that one, then wipe you out. Pick up this chest, give us some good, some good cooldown, area, or damage. I'm gonna go damage. Oh, oh, I mean. You gotta take the epic if it shows up, especially if it's attack speed. Oh man, that's gonna be crazy. Especially if you can get the attack speeds that's super being super low. That could be insane. If we have 40%, if we can get that up higher to like 60 or something, that could be wild. I think I think we'd want cooldown though, where it like shoots out like a machine gun, but the attack speed is mainly for like the projectiles that come out. So I don't know. I don't know. We do have an XP one. I probably should be dumping points into this. Okay. I wasted a ton of uh. XP there, but hey, it's all right. Hopefully we'll gain a, enough points off of this. I do want to get enough points to max out ice and the regular one, and then hopefully have enough to throw into the lightning as well, just as for like the extra precautionary like wave clear, since this is expert mode um, on Alpine. Um, that'll be nice. But mind you, we're also only doing one one shop with, without buying anything. So the second shop, we can hopefully have 100 gold and just go all out and buy buy a load of stuff. But right now, it's not looking too good because we're only at 12 gold. So we'll see how that goes. We shall see how that goes. So far, we're looking okay. Alright. Not bad, not bad, not bad. A chunk here. Uh, we do got 10 points. Let's uh, max out XP. Then we'll start... <clears throat> Sorry, we'll start dumping points into this to try and get more projectiles. That's not a bad one. I mean, we could go duration. Status duration could be huge, and area, of course, would be massive. Oh yeah, look at that. Now we got three, three ice ones going out. Heck yeah, dude. Be unstoppable. Too easy, dude. Too freaking easy. And if we can get the ice one that burns, oh, that'll be massive. Okay. I kill it before it freaking heals it to full health, man. Oh, man. Damage? Ooh, projectiles, baby. I love my projectiles. Love them. Alright, um, cooldown, projectiles. Projectiles could be really good with the ice, though. So I'm gonna take that. Especially if we don't, because, like, if you can get, like, I don't even think it's possible, but if you could somehow get 20 projectiles for ice, that would be in freaking insane. Okay, that was too easy, dude. Just shredded that elite. What about this guy? Dude, they even came by and healed them, and it, 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 it like it didn't do any healing. Okay, that was crazy. We just melted that one. We melted that one. Pick you up. Gonna melt the crap out of this guy. Yep, melted him. I am walking around willy-nilly and just taking damage um, however I feel like it, so I do gotta be careful on that. Because we do only have three gold hearts. Or gold hearts. Three red hearts. Okay. I mean, we are up to 23 points, so we could max out um, some stuffs here. So let's see, we can max out um, probably this guy. Actually, you know what? Let's max this out first. Max out this as well. Get this. Get this. Get you. Oh, crap. We don't have any. Okay. Well, then that's all right. Crap, dude. I totally didn't see that there. Okay. I'm gonna shred through this guy pretty quickly, so. Okay. 
Okay. Actually, we're not shredding through them as quickly as I thought we'd be shredding through them. Which is also a little worrisome. Okay. I'm just running around trying to pick up XP. Well, I still can. Since I don't have a ring on me. Okay. Okay, we just destroyed him with that. All of our orbs went right at him at the end there. Um, this one, I'm not buying anything. Boom. Missing. Unravel the mystery. What would happen if you left Noki's realm empty handed seven times? So we unlock missing. Which is the character that we will uh, see after this episode. We'll probably end up running them in the next uh, episode. Going right on back to Midgard, baby. Gotta love Midgard. Paralyzing enemies will receive 50% more damage from crits. Okay, I mean, we're not really paralyzing anything, so that's kind of a waste of a relic for us. But um, that's alright. We'll take it. At least now when we go to the shop, we can actually buy stuff. Also, if we can get, like, three to 500 uh, seedlings this run, that would be pretty gnarly as well. Ooh, this one's actually super good for what we're running this this build. Um, for the freezing aspect. So this this item could be very good. This could be a very good relic for us. Since we're doing the, the freezing kind of uh, build. Okay. Yeah, we're, we're, we're looking huge right now. Uh, I'll get this. Area and cooldown, damage and cooldown, damage and projectiles could be huge. This one I definitely want damage and projectiles if possible. Uh, you know what? Damage and cooldown works just as just as well. I do want status duration maxed out. Um, duration maxed out as well could be pretty good. Um, yeah, because it definitely goes out farther with duration maxed out. I think. I think. Um, or maybe that's the area. I don't know. But right now we're looking pretty good. I don't think I don't think we're running into any issues at the moment, so I, I feel pretty good about this. Okay, we'll just wipe these birds out, and then we'll be on our way. Um, I do want to head down to the other altar. Okay, well, we wiped out both of them. Um, another chest. I do want to pick that chest up in case it gives us something good. Um, you never know. You never know. What are you going to give us? Item attraction. Area. Projectile speed. Let's go area. Let's juice that up to like 100%, baby. Let's juice it up. Okay. Loads of gold there. I'm going to make my way down to this other altar. See what we got happening down here. Boom. I will pop this. To try and get some wave clear going. On our way over here. Of course, burn damage increase. Actually, this could be very good for us. Because our ice damage has a chance to burn. So getting this could actually be huge. Because that would just increase the burn damage on our ice burning from this. Free status has a, now has a 50% chance to apply burn damage, so maxing out burn damage could actually be really good too. This could be huge. So maxing out burn damage on top of status duration, which maxes out like the uh, freezing aspect or even the burning aspect, like any status effect basically, which could be huge. I don't know if we're going to shred Astrid, but I mean, maybe, maybe, maybe we'll do just that. I do want to end up leaving with a ring though, because oh my god, there is so much XP that we are not collecting and it kind of hurts my soul a little bit. Like, there is so much XP that I just want to pick up. But there's just no way of getting it unless we can somehow get a ring. Oh my gosh, this is insane. Like, the, like I don't even necessarily care about the wave clear because the wave clear isn't that impressive to me with uh, this. It's the massive amount of XP on the ground that like puts me in awe. 
unlike Ace's freaking Helga, with uh, that wave clear, that wave clear is insane. With the exploding feathers, like the chain reaction on that is just wild. But this, there's just so much XP that like I just, you can't pick it all up unless you have a ring, man. Unless you have a ring. Which they definitely, I do want to try and up the chances of getting, or having items drop more. Because holy smokes, like, we don't have, like, like, items hardly drop from, like, you'll get a run where you get five, six, seven items that drop. And then you'll get another run that, like, doesn't drop them at all, like this. Like, we've had, I think, one drop this entire run, and that was the fireballs. Um, other than that, we have not had an item drop at all. Which kind of sucks. Damn it. I heard a chest drop, so I was gonna make my way over that. <sighs> damage increase. Ooh, experience plus 5%. You gotta take the damage. It's a blue one, man. It's not a green one. Another chest. I mean, we are getting more chests, which that, that I am grateful for. But getting, um... Like, other item drops is what I kind of want. Mm. Damage. Cooldown, or duration is crazy. 1.29 up to 1.63. But I want, I think I want damage more. We got 18 points. So I'm gonna buy some stuff. Okay. Probably after I wipe these, these guys out. So there's a there's a bunch of them floating around. Um let's get this now. Let's get this now. Let's get this for sure. That's a huge one. Then I'll max this out. We'll go from there. Okay. We're gonna go all in on trying to get more hearts as well for the shop. Problem is we only have 34 gold. We didn't get a lot of gold for the shop. So hopefully we can make something happen. Okay. We're getting low on HP, which is a little scary. Okay. Whoo, we just barely missed him. Holy smokes. Take projectile speed. Oh my god, we froze him just in time. Right before that dash would have killed us, probably. Or it's just gonna get us that low. Damn it, man, man. Don't kill us. Do not kill us. Do not freaking kill us, man. Oh my god! I couldn't dash! You gotta be fucking kidding me. Oh my god. What a waste of a run, man. I mean, we did unlock the new character, which is cool, but it's like, what a waste of a run. That means we gotta do another run. Oh, but at least we're not gonna be held back anymore. We don't have to worry about running Ice Run again. We can run freaking Lightning, Fireball, whatever. But, uh, oh well. Hopefully y'all enjoyed this one. Um, I know it was kind of a pain in the butt, but, um, yeah, hopefully y'all enjoyed. If so, make sure you guys tap that like button down below. I'd greatly appreciate it. If you guys are new to the channel, definitely make sure you guys, um... Smash that subscribe button down below. I'd greatly appreciate it. And uh, helps me out a lot. Let's me know that you guys are enjoying the content and are willing to come back and watch some more. Um, let's see. I'm, I'm trying to debate. This would could increase it, the drop probability um, in boxes up higher. So I guess I'll take that. Um, but yeah, hopefully y'all enjoyed this one. We'll try uh, the new character out in the next episode. And uh, yeah, this has been Nordic Ashes. Peace out.